To get a quick overview of the condition of your business, you may compare some of the key business parameters month to month. Using a comparison chart makes the task easy for you. Hello everyone, welcome to Excel Demi, your day-to-day -day Excel and VFA tutorial helpline. This is Hadiul Bashar and today I'll demonstrate how to create a month to month comparison chart in Excel. For this video, I'll use Microsoft Excel 365. Let's briefly understand a comparison chart. A comparison chart is a representation of business parameters within a set period of time. Here's an example of a business data set. This includes a month, cost, and sales data. I'll calculate the revenue and create a month to month comparison chart using this data set. Let's calculate the revenue first. Revenue is the difference between sales and cost. To calculate the revenue for January, go to cell E5 type equal D5 minus C5 and hit the enter key. Here the revenue for January is calculated. I will use the autofill feature to calculate the revenue quickly. Double click on this autofill icon and this completes our data set. Next I will create the comparison chart. Select cells B4 to E16, move to the insert tab. From the chart section click on recommended charts. This will open insert chart window. Go to all charts. Here you will see multiple options for your chart. In my case, I will stick with the default chart that is the clustered column chart. Click OK to get the clustered column chart. You can see a month to month comparison of cost, sales and revenue in this chart. Place the chart here to get a clear view of the data set. Set the chart title as a month to month comparison chart. You can try out different chart options. For example, you can present your dataset in a combo chart which is a combination of multiple types of charts. To create a combo chart, move to the chart design contextual tab. From the type section, select change chart type. The change chart type window is open. You will find the combo chart at the bottom of the list. Click on the combo chart. This will suggest using a clustered column line chart. In this combination, Cost and sales will be presented as clustered column charts and the revenue will be presented as a line chart. Now click on OK. Great, our combo chart is nearly ready. Let's change the color of the sales series. Select the sales series, right click on it, choose the fill option to change the shape fill. You will find different available options to change the shape fill. You can choose the option according to your choice. In my case, from the standard colors, I am selecting dark red. You can see the sales series color has changed to dark red. This makes it easier to see the revenue line. There you go, the combo chart is ready. I have demonstrated the step-by-step -step guide for creating a month-to-month -month comparison Excel chart. Hopefully, you can apply this knowledge to make your own comparison chart according to your requirement and convenience. You can download the practice workbook from the video description to sharpen your Excel skills. Feel free to leave any questions, suggestions, or feedback in the comment section below. To check out our Excel blogs, you can visit excelremy.com. For more content like this, make sure to subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching our video. Bye.